big advantage for, for you to be in ProX. One is not only you know, the time it takes for you to do the trades, but let's say the experience level of the people doing the trades. Uh, I talk to a lot of people sometimes and say, well, what should I do? Should I just put in a market order uh, and, and wait for it to happen, or should I do something else? Well, there are little tricks of the trade of, of getting a good price for selling an option, depending upon what the market is doing, uh, going at uh, setting a price that you think it's going to be at a minute from now, and picking a limit order, placing that limit order, seeing what happens, and then changing that limit order uh, sufficiently fast enough so that you can get the maximum available out of the marketplace. Now, you know, so that is, that's a, you know, it's an advantage in ProX because we're doing that for you. If you don't have those skills or, let's say, uh, decide, well, I'm going to put in all these limit orders and go out to breakfast or lunch, you come back and they execute it, you may have left a lot of money on the table, okay, because uh, the market is fairly dynamic. So, you know, uh, so for one thing, you know, I suggest don't use limit orders, <laughs> you want to, or market orders, you want to use limit orders, and you need to manage that. And there are tricks of being able to manage it successfully to improve your result. Uh, so you can take advantage of you get the advantage of that with Pro X, plus the time factor. Uh, the more trades you need to do, the more time it's going to take, and you got to pay attention to it. This is not something you just do haphazardly. Uh, you need to follow the plan that's published. Buy the stock, sell the call, sell the put, uh, put in those orders correctly. Watch what's happening. And, uh, and, and get them executed. Uh, the other thing is getting them executed is, is important. A lot of people feel that maybe they can outsmart the market, saying, well, I'll buy the equity today, maybe I'll sell the call tomorrow. Well, it's been our experience that, you know, uh, putting a plan in place is important and understanding the, you know, the kind of the result you expect. If you can get close to that result is to execute it, if you're trying to get more, a lot of times you'll get less because the market will go against you. Uh, tomorrow the price went down, the option you could have sold yesterday was worth 40 cents and now you can get 20 cents. You left 20 cents on the table because maybe you got greedy. Uh, so there's emotion involved. So you, get it, you emotionally get involved saying, I want more and you get less in the, in the final, final end. So, our analysts take that emotion kind of out of the equation. They're, it's their job to get you the best price on the plan we put in place. And that's when we publish those trades, their goal is depending upon what the market is doing right now, they're going to try to get the best premium on the option against the, the stock that's being, you know, that was bought. So that may be another advantage. They're not emotionally involved. They're involved in, in getting the plan executed uh, that's in front of them. So uh, that would also, again, you know, save you some time and take the emotion out of deciding, uh, you know, which option to sell and, and, and so forth. So you uh, might want to consider that in your decision.